Hey, hey, you're a... Oh, look at that. Looks like we're both late to class now. How unfortunate. But, uh... Looks like you have a hall pass, huh? Lucky duck, huh? Mind if I tag along? I mean, we're going to the same room, aren't we? Yeah, yeah, I... I distinctly remember staring at the back of your head at one time or another. Yeah, sounds familiar enough to me, but I understand either way. I just thought that coal and jewels might appreciate it. You know, the trifecta. I mean, God knows you want to get in with the trifecta, right? Or even if you don't, well, it's still sad sounding if you don't, don't it? Well, look at that. Look at that. A totally neutral decision has now been tipped in the scales of bias. Whether or not you intended it to, you'll be expressing an opinion, and a strong sort of opinion at that. And what do you think of me? The trifecta, the very ideals of popularity in this silly little caste system itself. What have you done? What have you done? Fair choose the right choice, and by the right choice, of course, of, of course, I mean. Good, good, I think this is what teachers mean when you're learning these sort of soft skills for real-world application. I think you're learning a lot, and what do you know? I'm teaching it to you. It's like I'm doing you a favor. So, consider my debt repaid in full for this, by the way. In fact, what debt even? You look familiar. It's not like I'm going to apologize for staring. It's not like I'm out here being the ass of any rubbernecker looking my way. Now it's your turn to be viewed as opposed to the viewer. Though, I have a feeling that it all comes back to being a viewer. Somehow. A viewer being viewed as a viewer by the viewed, if you will. Say that five times fast. Oh, no. I... I just have a feeling. A very important feeling that tells me that it's turtles all the way down. But at the heart, it's still all about me. Viewers viewing me, me, me. As I view them, viewing me, viewing them, viewing me. You with me? You're right, but you're not going to say it, are you? I just don't think it's narcissism if it's true. But if that's really all you have to add, then I don't think I have to listen, unfortunately. And it is unfortunate, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, pardon me for saying, but I've long since realized. Viewer might not be the right word for you. Hmm. No. I think the word I'm looking for in regards to how you view me as I view you is not in fact a viewer. Not even voyeur. But in fact, admirer. You like me. How coincidental is it that I also like me, right? We have so much in common, you know, to an extent. After all, it wasn't me who tried to ask out me to the back-to-school dance, if I recall. I'm afraid I can only lay that honor at your feet, sweet little Poindexter. I can't imagine any other reason you tried to approach me. Let alone approach me while in full metal bitch 
queen of the trifecta smoke. I swear, it's like you wanted to be left out of that lunchroom. So fortunate that you managed to hold your tongue after all that. It grants you a shred of dignity in all this. What have you been going around saying your intent was instead? That you just needed to make it from one side of the lunchroom to the other? That you bottom feeders were finally going to stick it to the top dogs and you were going to incite that revolution all by yourself? That my shoe was untied? Oh, I'm sure you got a million of them, kid. I'm sure of it. Sure of it. I do want to ask. Uh, how badly do you want to stick it to the pretty and rich and socially classy? I mean... Last time I checked, they are cranking out little thin-wristed unibombers faster than they were putting out Marvel movies, and it has been a while since I checked, so I think it's only reasonable if I ask what side of the coin that you're on. An enemy of your own people, or an enemy to me. I could find a use for you either way. Well, look at that. We're here. Good time for you to pencil me into that note, yeah? Ooh, better use a pen. Wouldn't want to get caught after all. That's just bad practice. Now, I suppose we could stroll into that classroom right now as almost strangers. Part ways. Never speak amongst each other again. I see a bright future pointing in that direction if that's precisely where you like to walk it. But I see opportunity in the strangest of places. Look, I need a favor. But I need the kind of favor that makes it look like I'm doing you a favor. If you're interested, ask. If not, well, oh, I, oh, 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 I'm glad you asked. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, really. Care to care, truly. Let me phrase it as matter of fact as I can. No more tiptoeing around it. I need money. You need a girlfriend. You want me as your girlfriend, and what do you know? I'm a girl, and you have money. How about it? Or did you really just want to squeeze it out of me, just to get that sweet, sweet desperation to brag about to your little nerd friends, like they'd ever believe you? <sighs> Look, things have been really tight this month at home, and I, I'd be willing to do whatever it takes to help my old pop, but my friends, my the very trifecta that says we're thick as thieves, that no one would dare come between us, no secret not shared. Well, there is one, a, a big one, and if they were to find out, I, I, I'd lose them forever. I can't get a job because they find out and they just, they can't, they can't. Maybe they're not worth sticking around and they really would just abandon me like that, but they're all I really got and I just, I just really need the money. I just, I, I just, to, just to make it through the month. I, I know you want me. I know because... I know what want looks like because I've never met a person who didn't want me. But now, I want you. I want you. I want you. I just need to make it through the month. I, he, he sustained a work injury and I just... 
You really are my only hope. I want you to want me. I want you. I want you. I want you. How was that? Good? Good, good. I'm worried I was overselling a little too much, but if I was able to get one of your little nerd references in there, I shouldn't be doing that bad. So how about it? How would you like to be on the arm of the most popular girl in school and know that you're putting her in your place all the while? The double fantasy of having me and owning me. Being yours. Hmm. Which is which? What is a pathetic, desperate gooner fantasy? And what's the hard knock and true? Maybe I just don't want to get a job because I was born to be service more than served. Maybe my pops is just fine. Maybe my Friends would support me through any struggle and aren't just Hollywood cliches made up by the socially malfeasant few to feel better about their sad, pathetic high school years. Like they aren't going to be reliving those years every day for the next 40 years, every time they tip-tap type away at their keyboards. This is a rather important important time in your social development. How would you like to feel like a winner? Even if only for a moment. A month even. As for everything else. I suppose you'll just have to find out after school at Bubble Bubble, the boba place down the street. I take brown sugar vanilla. Extra boba, by the way. No, no. After you. After you, of course. I insist. You're the only one who can make good. Remember?